happened? How you doing? Welcome to my channel. My name's Tammy. I'm Amy. That's my sister. <laughs> Little bit over here, she. Yeah. So today we're going to talk about bullying, suicide thoughts, suicidal, all that kind of stuff. You know stuff? You don't want to make this up. All that kind of stuff is what I was trying to say. All my life I've been bullied. Well, she has too. <laughs> All my life we've been bullied. It didn't get real, real bad until probably high school. People would, in high school, people would push us. They would, well, push me. I don't know about you. I can't speak for them. They pushed me. They throw money at me. Sorry, I just don't know how to turn off another case. They throw little pennies and nickels, dimes, stuff like that at me. I told them once that they don't keep, they uh, throw the money at me, throw the dollar bills. That was that a bit, I'm serious. They I kept got throwing. Uh, $20 bills. What did you do, bend over and show your huh? butt? <laughs> I'm kidding, I'm kidding, I'm kidding. I found a $20 in a bill of a book bag before you. Cool. Okay, anyways. So. <laughs> They also take let me see a bottle. They also take plastic bottles. And they poke a hole in the top of the lid. I remember this. And they would squirt, put water in it, and squirt it. I uh, water. Yeah. As you would walk down the hallway. And it is it raining? <laughs> <laughs> so what you know me? What a me? What a bird! <laughs> We is not with a bourbon. Then eventually we caught on to what was going on. And then they had these people that would be, there would be two, at least two boys. Well, I mean, there was hundreds. But there would be two people, and one guy would be looking at you, and the other would be in the locker. And his, the one that would look at you would be like, hey, Tammy, so-and-so wants to be with you. Or shot my cap. And when the buddy turned around, you're like, oh, no, no, no. You're stupid crap like that. You know, and you tell the Or they would send you, like, at the, at, around Valentine's Day at our school, we send, like, either suck your hearts or... A rose. A rose. I hate your notifications. Sorry about that. And they would sign it, like, anonymous from your secret admirer or some shit. Anyways, you know, if you, if you didn't, you would bully more. So, you, if you go and tell the teacher, well, in our school, they wouldn't do nothing. They tell them, just leave them alone. Do something about it. You go and tell the principal, they bring them in the office. You pick it on so and so, no, go on and tap back to him. Do something about it. People nowadays, you can't be doing that. It's the reason why, that's part of the reason why I've always wanted to cut myself or harm myself. And I don't think like that right now. I've always had those thoughts. I remember being 10 years old and my mom taking me to a therapist because I didn't want to play with the other kids. I didn't want to take a bath. I didn't. I was withdrawn. I was by myself. I was 10. And then when I was 12 or 13, it was 12 when my grandma passed away. And that just made me spiral out of, even more out of, even more into depression. Yeah, me too. And then, being 13, not having any friends, you're... You see your other classmates linking up and having kiss, you know, kissing and hugging hands, and you wish you had that, but you didn't. And, and and now that I'm older, I've had a boyfriend, I've had a girlfriend, but I still get bullied. And now most of the bullying is coming from y'all. Some of y'all. Some of y'all. And that's why. Well. I got sent this a couple of days ago. Now I know what it's like. Beware a pig. 
They're calling me a pig. You know, and I made a post. I took a picture of this. And it, it's metal. I looked it up on Amazon, where it come from. Nine dollars. I'm just saying. <laughs> so I want to thank the person for this. I know what I said in my post. I was like mad when I got it. I'm like hurt. And who wouldn't be? I mean, seriously, who wouldn't be get mad? You get some bullcrap like that. I have to bail it. Of course you did. But if it was me, I would understand. You know, like I thought they would be calling it be a pig or something. But that just motivates me to lose weight even more. Call me a pig all you want, honey. Can I talk? I don't give shut up shit. <laughs> I know you don't. Anyways. Yes, it hurt me. And I did say out of hurt that that was why I wanted to kill myself. But somebody took it the wrong way and called the cops on me again and gave them my mom's address. I ain't lived with my mom in over four months. Quit striking. <laughs> they gave me my mom's address. The cops were called. I don't think they showed up there, but they did here. Because, stupid. Called the dispatcher. <laughs> oh, not stupid. Okay. Called the dispatcher. Let me finish. Called the dispatcher and told them I lived here. So they did come out. She was here while they were here. And they basically, you okay? You okay? You going to do anything? Yep, I'm fine. They left. Pretty much. They were going to try to check the pack first. Yeah, they're going to try to. And that's another thing. The person thinks that that can't be a trap and a federal offense and all that. And yeah, yeah, I can. It brought okay. over. The cop told us it's, it's illegal. You shouldn't be doing that stuff. You can't get a fine for it. But what I'm trying to say is, I'm not planning on hurting myself. Why? I'm out of my mom's house. That was my biggest thing. I don't live with her anymore. That was another big <laughs> I love you, but you get on my nerves. Good, good. my nerves too. Good. You know, my nerves are yeah. good. <laughs> and it's just unnecessary. But I want to thank you because this is even, like, I, I know that I said it was hurtful and shit, but now it's like motivation. I'm going to keep doing me. I'm going to keep doing what I want to do. Y'all tell me to quit doing videos. I ain't doing what's going to make y'all happy. I'm doing what make me happy. This is Sorry, I didn't even get a phone call. I don't even know who it's from. What was I saying? Huh? What was I saying before you get the call? It was motivation. Oh. Thank you. It's just... No. It's just motivation. <laughs> it's just motivation to keep going. Keep going. Let me have that. Nope. Get it here. <laughs> Get another one. Duh. I'll show it. I'll show what it is in a minute. Um, but it's motivation to keep me going. To lose more weight. To have my surgery. Stop playing with crap. I'm just letting you talk. Go ahead. <laughs> and what I'm going to say is, like, thank you. If you, what? Thank you for the push. Yeah, thank you for the motivation. Thank you for the push. I don't need y'all to tell me I'm not losing weight when I know it is. What? I didn't say nothing. No, but I look. I'm going to stab her in the throat. Not literally. I'm going to shake you, motherfucker. Oh, I see. Wrong in. You can't tell that it's no. no. <laughs> that is sharp. Stop. Dumbass, fuck yourself. <laughs> I said, oh. Oh. Okay. <laughs> I thought you said, fuck yourself. You don't. <laughs> I 
hate my sister. Are you high? No. Can we get through this? Yes. Now, all for the jokes aside, suicide after the bully after the bully and shit. Like, who cares about that damn song? It's a joke. Get over it. But all jokes aside, suicide is not the answer. And if you're contemplating suicide, seek help. There will be a help hotline down in the description bar. If you want to commit suicide, hit me up on Facebook. Yeah. You know, if you need to talk, we're always available to talk. No, she's not. She's probably asleep. But I'm always... (laughs) I'm not always asleep, shit. I didn't go to bed till five this morning. Anyway, I woke up. <laughs> Either one of us are always available to talk. Hit me up. Hit me Tell me up. about your problem. Write me a letter if you feel like it. I mean, you don't even have to send it. Just write. Like, get your emotions out of you somehow. Other than taking something and. I noticed like I have been to a what's that place called? What? What's the place called? No. What? The Saturn Solomon. The Saturn Solomon. Is it incarceration or is that where you get locked up? I don't know. Anyways, I've been to a Saturn Solomon like four times. The last time I went to a Saturn Solomon was when Prince passed away. Oh my god. You should. But anyway, if you do need help or anything like that, there's an, either a number to call or write it, like get you a journal and just write your feelings. Because in school, that helped me a lot. If I, wanted, if I wanted to commit suicide in school by all the bullies and stuff, I got a journal and I wrote it down to get it out of, you know, it's like getting out of my mind. And getting it on paper was my way of coping. And it helped because, you know, I'm still here. Honestly, I do still have the thoughts every now and then. But it's because I'm alone. And I'm thinking about getting a puppy or a kitten. And if I do, I'm going to adopt them from a shelter. Just, just so I have somebody here. In my house, that will love me. I can talk to them, play with them. Yes, they. I mean, animals talk back. In a way. (laughs) But I mean, yeah, they make bark, bark, woof, woof. Yeah, whatever. That's how they talk back. No, you're sad. Right. And it's something that's gonna stay here longer than two minutes. But, but, shut up. But, but, suicide is real. And y'all have to realize that the reason why I keep saying that some of the things y'all say to me could affect me in a way that could push me to the edge. And if I'm going to honestly kill myself or, (laughs) shut up, let me talk. If I was honestly going to kill myself or even cut, I'm just going to do it. I'm not going to put it out the hay. I'm going to kill myself. I'm not going to ride it. No. I would have done that. And I've never, I've cut one time. But that was being over 10 years ago. And sometimes when I say it, I just want somebody to talk to. Honest to God. I just need a reason for somebody to ask me if I'm okay. Okay. No. You're here. <laughs> you made me go over. No, I didn't. But I need to come over and I said, are you going to? No. But if you sit back and think about it, the, the guy, I know his name is Zombie Boy. He was actually a man and he was a, a model. And he had tattoos covering from his balls 
head, which was a, of a brain. His face, excuse me, his face was of a uh, skull, and he had all tattoos all down his body. He was really famous and handsome. Right. No, I was thinking that too. <laughs> and he committed suicide because of all the hate he was getting. And then Robin Williams, he committed suicide because of all the hate and stuff he was getting. There's so many people nowadays that are committing suicide. The numbers a, are growing every day. There's a YouTuber not too long ago, like last, within the last three weeks. I don't remember his name. He was really cute and kind of young. I don't remember his name. But it, he committed suicide. There was you gotta people. watch what you say to people too. You like, never know. Cause if it's not me, it could be your friend. That you might say the wrong thing to and push him to the edge. And that can be on your conscience. You don't want right. something if you say something, somebody take it the wrong way and that person kills himself. That could be on your mind. You have to live with that for the rest of your life. Thinking the reason why they died is because of something I said. Take that to heart. And you know, sometimes when people are bullied, it's because they're being bullied either at home or somewhere else. They're not happy in their life. And they're objecting themselves to you, like projecting all the hate they're getting towards you because you're the weaker link. And I'm going to say, like, you can make fun of me all you want because you're making somebody else's happy. Like, I don't give two shits, man. Like, you going to make fun of Tammy? Don't. Go ahead and make fun of me all you want. I don't even care. only reason why I care is because I'm too kind-hearted. I'm a people pleaser. I used to be, but hell, sometimes you have to break away from it. That's why I don't read my comments half the time. That's I don't read my comments at all, Tanker. I even get the call. The only reason why I come here is because I'm reading the comments. Right. Man, yeah, forget you. I don't need that. <laughs> but anyways, I hope this touches somebody's heart and gives them a different view of us and of other people. Like I said before, there's a saying, and it is a church a Bible saying, if you will, do unto others as you would want others to do unto you. Treat, treat people as you want to be treated. If you want somebody, to, if, if you go and, yes I'm preaching, if you go and smack your neighbor, your neighbor going to smack me back. Even harder. <laughs> if you go and cuss your, bitch, your neighbor, <laughs> you know what my said is, if you ain't got nothing else to say, don't say anything at all. It's basically so funny. Wow. Well, but, I mean, that's... Anyway. Preach it, sister. I'm in a mood. Shut up. Sister, tell me the spirit has lifted you. Lord Jesus. I puke you in the name of... <laughs> I didn't hit her. Yeah? No. Okay. Anyways. <laughs> but I hope this helps somebody. I hope it opens y'all's eyes to bully and how real this really is. It's not good it's thing. Serious. I mean, I don't, it is. And I'm trying to express that. I don't know if it's coming off like that. But all jokes aside, we are trying to be serious. Because I don't agree with bullying. And I try my hardest not to bully unless it's family. And that's family, so, like... And I don't even but try I don't to bully her most of the time. Yes. When did I bully you? Yesterday. What? I didn't talk to you yesterday. Yes. Did you? Did I? 
Yeah, you can come out. Were you okay? I heard it really loud, but oh. I hope you enjoyed this video. I hope we helped at least one person. Before, oh, this is lip gloss. It's one of those DIY toy things. It's like lava. Anyways, thank you for watching. I hope you enjoyed this video. Give it a like. It helps me channel out. When did you become Irish? I don't know. I am Irish. So I'm since I'm born. I don't know. Shut up. Ex I don't know. <laughs> Anyways, give the video a like. Subscribe. Hit the notification bell. For, you get notified every time I upload. And the reason why I'm wearing the same shirts because we're filming on the same day as the last video. Before you go, give me a kiss. Bye, I love you.